Hey, Jewelers, the best come make your piece here. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> you've been going to training for this, you're learning this by yourself. <laughs> yeah, right, right. <laughs> thanks for coming on board, mate. Nah, no worries. No, no, and thanks there, for doing course. this as well. It's, uh, nah, of course, of course. A pleasure. It's a pleasure to always be. You've got a decent size uh, area now. Uh, 60 square meters. Yeah. It's a big area, mate. Yeah. Not as big as. Hoshi's Wari, yeah, well, is it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hoshi's Wari. Right, and then that, you just tuck that down in there somewhere. The, um, sorry, that one's. Okay. Um, yes. And just to be able to be happy to go. Oh, That's alright, no, that was really good. I'll go with that again. <laughs> for everything, so yeah, so I've always enjoyed the love, the, the, the watch shows for the love shows. Shit. <laughs> 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 I say That's the love right, shows. That good though, all that laughing, yeah, yeah. That's good. So our aim is to just keep getting bigger and better. better. Oh, <clears throat> right, that's right, that's right. So yeah, so. So what would I start with? Say, say. What was, that, what was the first? Uh, our aim, yeah? Supplies, <laughs> That's a business answer there, I like that. Um, An industry leader, I believe. Yeah. I'm going to bring my full force to the show and show everyone what I'm all about. Done, yeah? Yeah, yeah. 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 Thanks, so, bro. I'll see you, Charlie. Yeah. In June, mate. I'll see you, um, I'll see you, you there. Well done, mate. When is it? It's in a few weeks, isn't it? No, I've just got a while. Yeah, ten September, weeks. Right? Ten weeks, September, right? Ten weeks, yeah. As many Rolexes and APs as you can. Mm -hmm. Wait six months a year, it would have gone up a lot. That's why I just advise everyone from years ago, years ago, just buy as many as you can. Depends if you like your chain long or not. I, I prefer it. I think that looks better. Thank you. That looks better than that, doesn't it? 10 points here. Yeah? I'll do it for him, it'll be, I think, around 10k each, roughly. Roughly. <laughs> what, what, what size point is this? 10. Ah, small one. So you started with watches when you were a teenager. Yeah. So how did you get into like starting with watches? How did you even begin? Basically, so bits and pieces of jewellery and watches were offered to me at a young age. And just from throughout kind of the circle and network of people that I had. And I just kind of took a shot, I took a punt and I bought what I thought was a good deal and what I could make money on and I just, it slowly became an everyday thing for me, just buying and selling, buying and selling and then after some years to come, I built a team, I built a brand, I put a system in place and I just kept building and pushing this brand and we started getting some recognition and attraction from, from people all over the UK, from all around, from our social media slowly started getting recognised by different celebrities and footballers and rappers etc and we slowly started being known for our special custom pieces and being known for our, our hot, kind of new, fresh stuff that other people didn't have. Is there a favourite or like a piece that really felt like a transitional point for you when you made it, where you were like, I'm entering a different league now as a jeweller? The pieces we done in the beginning, they got our name out there a little, a little bit, but they weren't like pieces that shaped the UK custom jewellery game and the other jewellers that were making custom stuff. It wasn't as good as their best pieces, it wasn't. But then, after some years, I kept creating, making, and then we started making stuff that was better than what everyone else made. Uh, I.e., we made a piece for Young Ads at the time, uh, with, with the goat head and the 29, and then the ring we done for him. Then, like, the AJ Tracy pieces, then, like, the K-Trap piece. Those kind of pieces around that time, remember, this is, like, five-plus years ago. The first custom piece I actually made was for a friend of mine. His rap name is uh, H. Maneda. The first piece I made for him actually was his Mache Money M, two M's. That's the first piece I made for any kind of, not just rapper, but anyone. That's the first custom piece I made. And he put his trust in me and he let me make the piece for him. So I have to respect him and thank him always for that. And then some after, other people after that um, let me make some pieces for me and they trusted my work, i.e. Uh, crept and uh, some other people. So then... When it got to the point of people like AJ Tracy reaching out to us, wanting us to make their piece for them, 
that's when you start realizing that well, this isn't like kind of me just knowing and meeting people and talking them into wanting to do something with me and you know um, that's when you start realizing that kind of where you're in a small office where no one can walk by and find you and they're contacting you from Instagram just to come and specifically see you and they're buying and you're starting to do more business from all than all these shops all over the UK who are like who've been there for 20 years and you're you're you're, you're doing so many sales and you're realizing well wow, like I'm actually now becoming a well-known established name for jewelry and that's that's when that's when it starts becoming a turning point and you start understanding and realizing that there's no limit to this and there's no there's no there's no stopping you can literally achieve anything you you, you want to achieve you can go as far as you want to go and if you manifest it in your mind and you believe in it it can truly come true and that's the secret when you start understanding that and you start believing that it's reality and it does become reality Crazy, that. Has he seen it? Nah. He hasn't he seen it. No, no, no. Sir, he ain't seen it. Nah, he ain't seen it. Yet. He's cutting for it. <laughs> He's dying for it. <laughs> He's dying for it. But we ain't. We don't show no more in it until it's until they get it because just the surprise factor. This one's crazy still. The way it was gleaming when you was walking in. Yeah, yeah. What would you say is the best pendant you made? All pendants are unique. It's, they're all different. Like slow ties was just different. The colours, etc., etc., etc. It's just. I don't know, man. We've got some nice stuff loading though. It's crazy when you've got a pendant that has one of You've got all in the middle of these? Yeah, all through the middle of the links. It'll be a bigger size uh, Cuban though. Yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah. Fat rocks with the middle. They're both sick. They're just different. They're very different. But, uh, this one, this what the DL and this one. Yeah, yeah. the DL is crazy in this. DL the DL's crazy in this. Right. Camera. Imagine these two. Skip up. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Migo shit. What's been going on anyway? Nothing, man. New music coming? Yeah. Album? Yeah, whole sick, sick, sick. sick. Yeah. I've just been loaded, innit? Because like, we don't, when we come, we just come like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're just about to just start releasing the so, You sold out the O2 last time, innit? Yeah. Um, so where do we go from the there? Arena. Yeah, where do you go from there? Wembley Stadium? Nah, 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 nah. No? Not yet, bro. Fucking mm -hmm. no. Wembley Stadium's. 80,000. Is it 80? Yeah. Oh, man. What's that then? What's going on? We finally got you back here, yeah? This thing here, yeah? Got, um, the big boy. Have we got a new... Have we got an that's older style? That's, that's the one I was looking at the other day, though. But that's a small one. That's not the same. So. The girl's the tea. Oh, it's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. It's lovely. Nice one, bro. Nice to meet you, man. Thanks for coming through. So guys, today we're going to talk about this beautiful piece that I have in front of me. We made this for Stephen Bergerin, who plays for Tottenham, um, and this is an amazing piece. It's a very unique piece, it's a very special piece, it has a lot of detail, has a lot of intricacy. If you look closely, you can see we've used round diamonds and emerald cut diamonds, but in a camouflage pattern kind of strategy. What I like about it is the first of its kind, it's never been done like this before, using round diamonds and emerald cut diamonds in such a pattern. It's, it's amazing, the contrast it gives, the different shapes of diamonds and everything is incredible. This is a crazy piece because it's flooded from every side, edge to edge, and this actually takes 30 carats of emerald cut diamonds alone and 20 carats of round diamonds. So this is totaling to 50 carats worth of diamonds. And I know he's going to be absolutely ecstatic about it. It came out amazing. We've used big pointers in the bezel. The piece is domed, it's 3D. We've got diamonds, uh, flower set all around the sides, all the edges. We've got his um, son's names engraved on the back as well, just for some small extra detail. And I'm really happy with this piece, so... Peace out, guys. In your city, looking for it, moving, got me told. Jeffrey, we made, now we got it, running back to bro. She thinking villa, I was thinking two weeks on the boat. Got bunnies yeah. with ya, my dogs are jacking loves up on us, go. Feeling like you have no, my hoes came together. Not a Gina, it's Martin Nicoretta. At the Crip Coachella, cactus.
that's in the cellar Crip back like go tell us Cactus slap forever, yeah Diamonds King Kong, how they beating on my chest The link so long, this shit about to touch me So guys, we're here now with Stephen Bergwine And we're about to surprise him now with his piece Let's see what he thinks, guys Let's see what he thinks of it Football or rapper now? Now you need to join Amigos as well. Yeah, this one is sick. You can join Quincy Proms in his rap videos now. <laughs> <laughs> Quincy Proms is rapping now, yeah? Yeah, he raps, bro. He's yeah, good, yeah, 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 he's decent. Ali, what's it? That's crazy. Hey, this one is sick. Where's your mirror? Oh, oh, I want here. Look at that. That's silly. Liquor, liquor. Liquor, liquor. We went in on this piece here, huh? Look at yeah, the back of it. Well. The back of it for your your son. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Yeah, this one is this is sick, man. <laughs> that is straight rapper, bro. <laughs> straight. That's crazy. Pull up in the party with that one. Hey. And we just want to say thank you for all the. Custom he brought us, everyone he referred to us. Like, you, you, no, honestly, you, the, we really, really flattered for what you've done for us. You've done a lot, so thank you, thank we really you. appreciate everything. And it's just something from us. It needs to be, you're part of the team now. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, guys. Yes. Yeah, sick, man. Part of a jewelers now. You see it? <laughs> <laughs> He's embedded in the team. <laughs> We're going to get a tattoo next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, I'm happy, man. This is sick, man. Yeah. Bro, this piece. <laughs> what is the one six can I ask? It's, it's the, it's, uh, the date's your son's one. Uh, my son. And oh, you know okay. both. Which one's I have two. Yeah, two sons, you know. Yeah. Oh, you one is 10 sons, April yeah. and one is 26th of uh, them. Okay, okay, okay. So it's first the days of like yeah. still born. Yeah. What happens if you have a third kid? Then you're gonna have to <laughs> <laughs> do an extension. <laughs> when I went to his house, yeah. his dad trapped me in the room. I was like, so how much is this? What value is this? How do I know he's getting a good deal, etc. How old are you, Stephen? Twenty-three. You're still a baby, aren't you? <laughs> it's Twenty-three, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's still a baby. It's a good age. Bro. I'm thirty-seven, bro. You wouldn't say that. Yeah, yeah, I feel it in my legs though, in my back. Yeah. Come <laughs> <Am I not? laughs> He only goes one round. <laughs> yeah, one. <laughs> Two minutes in my back. Tap out. Yeah, tap tap. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to be a bit cliche now, and I'm going to ask you guys please to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like and comment and share, and we're looking forward to bringing you guys some more content.